Hey guys, it's on 93 again, and uh, I'm back finally with another video. I had to uh, reinstall my Oblivion, and uh, you know how all that goes. But in this one, I'm going to show you how to mod Oblivion on Windows 7. I know some people might have questions, so uh, here we go. So uh, you're going to want to find your mod. I got uh, this one off of Planet Elder Scrolls. Just uh, go scroll down and click on the file. I already have mine downloaded here. Use mine on Google. I use Google Chrome, and that's how the downloader goes. So you're gonna want to right-click or click that little drop-down arrow and go to open the show in the folder, and um, just clear that out. Snap this over here to the side. Here we go. Scroll down, and you're gonna need WinWar WinRAR to do extract these files but uh, anyway right click and go to extract and it'll have your download path or your extract path so just click OK and let it do its thing and if you go up there'll be uh, there are the files they're all extracted and there you have your ESP file your textures and your meshes alright so now that you have those you're going to want to go to your Oblivion icon right click it and scroll up to open file location and then there you you have your Oblivion data folder up there at the top. So just open that, and there you got all your files, all the ESPs and all that from other mods. So uh, once you have that, just let me snap this over here. All right, now that you have those, you're just gonna want to drag the ESP file, just drag it and drop it into the data folder. Nice and simple. So do you? With Windows 7 you'll need permission, just hit continue and your ESP files in there. Same thing with the textures. Just uh it'll ask you to overwrite, just click yes, and then do it for all of them, just hit continue. And then they'll, they'll still be in your folder and I just do it again just to double check, and make sure. And you want to do the same thing with the meshes. Just drag and drop and overwrite them. Just click just continue. Double checking again. Alright, and always look at the README as it'll most of the time tell you where the armor, or maybe if it's a house mod, where you can find it. But just, yeah, always read the README. Always read it. Divine Elegance in the Imperial City. Okay, so just close that and close this. Minimize that. Click your open up your Oblivion. Go to your data files and look for your mod that you just input. I had Elegant Vest, just check that off, click OK, and you're ready to play. So uh, yeah, sorry it's been a while since I made a video, but uh, I've been busy with school and all that. So um, yeah, if you guys have any suggestions or any videos you'd like to see, just let me know, because I now have Oblivion back up, and I'll be happy to make those for you. So. Uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.